we're generating about two to three percent of the worldwide mobile and, and land-based IP traffic. We've got all of our source code, all of our models, all of our animations, all of the assets are all being run on top of Linux. We love the performance, we love the reliability and robustness of it. I love the Steam announcements. That's an opportunity to maybe really help the desktop. This February this year, we shipped um, a Steam client uh, for Linux. And as much as anything, that was a, a signal to our development partners that we really were serious about this Linux thing that we were talking with them about. And now today, we have 198 games that we're running on, on Linux. Steam is this one company that has a vision for how to do things, and I think that will force a lot of the other vendors around them to realize, hey, if this is the way Steam is going, we need to do the same thing because we can't afford to be different in this respect because we want people to be able to play games on our platform too. We've seen tremendous evolution and innovation in the open space. We think that that process is going to continue, and we think that we need to be knocking down as many barriers and reducing friction, not going in the other direction. What we became convinced of is that Linux really is the future of gaming.